just staring at him, not knowing what to say, and him asking me if I was okay. And I said, yes, but Papa, why have you never told us your incredible story? He just shrugged and said, you never asked. And those things that people ask, we just tell them. Our father made it a point to never talk politics with us. The only important things that mattered were how we were, how school was going, and what cartoons were currently watching. <laughs> of course, as we got older, the conversation matured. To us, he was just Papa, the father, and the occasional farmer. Thank you, Papa, for protecting us from your work, for being such an amazing father to us. From a young age, Papa always told us to believe in ourselves and to challenge, and to challenge ourselves. If we didn't challenge ourselves, he challenged us. Every time we would come back from university, Papa would ask us questions about our courses that we were taking. And Angela and I would sit there in shock as we wondered where this man formed the time to study the theory of rocket science and organic chemistry. We didn't realize that he was actually improving the way we communicate our, um, our um, ideas. We'd always say, he would always say that if you can explain the content of your courses to a mere farmer, then you fully understand the material. So Angela and I were always excited to get back from school and discuss the courses that we had taken. Thank you, Papa, for always believing in us, for pushing us to challenge ourselves. Thank you, Papa, for also providing all the tools we needed to chase our dreams, whether it was financially by getting us through school, with your never-ending words of wisdom and encouragement every time we came back from school. So Angela has two degrees in medicine, and I will have two degrees in engineering very soon, and we are both working in our respective fields. And we owe, we owe all of this firstly to God, but secondly to the amazing parents that he blessed us with. Finally, I would like to welcome our wonderful guests again. Today is not a giveaway. It is a union of two families in Rukundo. Remember, I said that if there is one phrase I want you to take away from my speech, it is that Rukundo is a love of stay and multiply now that we have the addition of Amanya and your amazing family. Thank you. Wow.